Hey guys, thank you so much for being here. This will be a pretty quick video, but today I just wanted to show you some of the products that I use to make mirrors. Uh, not a whole lot involved, and that's really why I love them. They are pretty simple once you find the products that you like. So I just wanted to show you what I currently use. Um, I did another video on all the different types of wood boards that I use. So if you are interested um, in that, I recommend checking that video out. But what I typically use is these 22 inch boards from Hobby Lobby. This one is painted black. Normally they just come blank like this and I use a black base coat. 22 inches is typically what I use though. So a 22 inch board and then I use a 12 inch mirror. So these mirrors I get at Hobby Lobby. Craft mirror, $6.99 for this one. And I really love these. They have a bevel rim which looks really pretty when it's glued onto the mirror. These have been my favorite so far. Um, I was looking online. Michaels also has some very similar. The ones I found at Michaels are 14 inch and they look very similar to these and they're $7.99. And then Hobby Lobby. The Hobby Lobby has eight inch which is $4.99. And then the 12 inch is $6.99. They might have other sizes in the store, but I, I do go to the store sometimes to browse around, but for the most part, I know what I like and I just order them in bulk online. But those are the mirrors. You can use really any craft mirror, any craft store has them. I've seen them at Hobby Lobby, Michaels, Joann's, um, but most craft stores should have, if you ask for craft mirrors, they should have them in um, some different sizes. So those are the ones I use. The dimensions just work pretty well. The 22 and then, oop, there's my ring light. <laughs> 12 inch mirror. I can show you, I actually have a couple done that I can show you afterwards. So that's the board and mirror that I use. And then when working with larger, circles. I find it really helpful to have an extra large compass. This one, this one is like super sturdy and holds my chalk pencil really well in there. The ends are very sharp, so be careful. But this one is called Mr. Pen Professional Large Compass for Woodworking and I got it on Amazon and it's $14.99. I will leave a link for everything that I show you today in the description below. Uh, so yes, this one, Amazon, $14.99. Super great, it makes circles up to 30 inches. So awesome for working on bigger surfaces. And then lastly, these are what I use to secure the mirror onto the wood. Gorilla Glue mounting tape squares. I'll show you what these look like. They're just these little glue tabs. And four squares holds up to one pound which these 12 inch mirrors are about one pound. So all you have to do is pop four of these on the back and you're good to go. I haven't had any issues with them. I love just how easy they are. You can really use any type of glue, but I just like convenience and whatever is the least messy. So these have been awesome. And these you can get, I've seen them at uh, craft stores, Michaels, Hobby Lobby also on Amazon and one pack, this pack comes with 24 squares. 
so yeah that is really it a couple back here that are done that i can show you i've been dying to show someone these so i know you guys will appreciate it it's kind of weird taking pictures or videos of mirrors because you can see all my junk in the background but we'll just roll with it so this is a mirror that i just completed the customer wanted just very bright, colorful. So that's exactly what I did. Love this one. And these um, boards from Hobby Lobby are so light and so easy to hang. So there's that one. And then I just finished this one. It's so beautiful. I love the colors. Pretty, pretty. And I can show you what these look like hung up too. I'll just flip the camera around real quick. Right now I just have them hung up in my art room. So pretty. And that is all I have for you guys today. I hope that you found this video useful. And if you enjoyed it, please like and subscribe to my YouTube channel for weekly videos. And we will see you guys next time.